All right, what's going on, everybody? We headed back out here on Lake Murray. We're gonna try to get back on some of these herring fish. Only problem is, it got cold again last night. Got a little bit of fog, so I don't know what in the world is gonna happen. I think we're gonna catch some. But look, I got a hodgepodge of stuff tied on. I got all kind of weird stuff tied on. I ain't got no clue what we're gonna catch these fish on, but we're gonna try them. We're just gonna see what they're gonna bite, see if we can't catch some big ones. We're gonna pick up my man Darrell, Dale Starkey. We're gonna get after him, son. I'm ready to go. When I tell you, I got darn everything out. Look, I even got, I even got the darn Matt B. Tater Hog in the original packaging still. Some kind of tater, tater, swimmer, tater hater, something, something, some kind of weird, angry something. But we're gonna see if we can't catch one off of that bad boy, too. That'll make old tater happy. I got another one. Okay. I meant to ask, I said, shit, I hope we don't get a ticket. No, I got one. That's my new knee. Cold this morning. It is cold. <laughs> it is cold. <laughs> I got long johns on underneath uh... <laughs> I think that was just one pitch. But it was pretty sight. Based on our morning, you know. Got him. Got him. Do I need to flip him in the boat with the camera? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a big one. He looked like a toad when he jumped. Like a man. Well, I don't know why I don't like it, but he sure not to do that. Oh! 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 Look at him jumping out there! I didn't even hook him until I got the hook set. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I had some slack in my What you got, Darrell? Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, it don't matter. Yeah. Yeah, I think they got a hook on 
That ain't nowhere near the size of that one that's falling. When I fall like it's four inches across the back. Yeah, he looked big for mine. Yeah. We've been out here at Lake Mary. Let me tell you this one important thing. Uh, when you're fishing, these jointed swim baits like, like this one right here or, or the Seville. You know, we've been throwing both of them. Uh, make sure you wind them, you know, really fast. You know, sometimes they want them slow, but 90% of the time they want them, them bad boys burning. And that's, that's a high speed reel and fluorocarbon. But you want to reel it as fast as you can without having what I call a blowout. And a blowout is when you reeling it and it just, you know, out the top of the water and it ain't ratting right. You just want to make sure it's got that, that wobble and just burn it just as fast as you can. And that's usually going to trigger that reaction bite. <laughs> There. Ah, there's a pretty one right there. Yeah. Hey, seen them fish. Whew, mercy. Put him back. Eyes easing up. I saw them fish bust. And I threw that swim bait up there and I got a ball, but usually that ain't, I usually don't like, like bait no, uh, hitting those swim baits whenever they're busting like that. So switched over to the old top water. That's a prototype deal. He smashed that bad boy. Let's see if we can catch another one. All right, we're gonna call it a day. It's getting on up to about one o'clock. I got some stuff I got to do, but uh, you know, it was a pretty decent day. The, the herring bite really ain't kicked in good, and it's been cold the last few nights. Uh, I think it's kind of knocking them in the head a little bit, but uh, a couple more weeks, this thing's going to be wide open. Uh, hopefully, I can get some better videos for you. Maybe some top water stuff or some blow ups and all that. I'm going to try it anyway. But I uh, appreciate everybody for watching. Uh, if you like the content that I'm putting out, make sure you subscribe. Hey, man, we'll catch you on the water.